It's what many people want for Christmas, the gift of youth. And now getting it is easier than ever. At least it'll look that way after you see the doctor. Dr. Alberico Sessa is here to explain. Hello, thank you so much Hi. for coming in. We appreciate it. Thank you for having me. It's so a pleasure. It's, it's not so complicated now to get a facelift, is it? Not as much as it used to be. And I know you're doing something very special with that. Tell me about it. Yeah, I'd like to call it, uh, uh, my facelift is called, I call it the smart lift. Mm -hmm. And uh, what it is, is uh, it's a modification of the standard facelift. Uh, the standard facelift uh, has been around since the 60s. Uh, most people are afraid of the, the extended downtime and the swelling and the bruising associated with that. Uh, the smart lift is, fa is fantastic because it, uh, uh, with minimal incision uh, and scarring, I'm able to do things with the tissues that allow people to recover so much quicker with less bruising uh, that allows them to get back to their normal activities quicker. And we're seeing some photos of some before and afters of some of your patients now. So tell us, how, how much time is involved with something like this? Well, the, the great thing about it is it usually takes about 90 minutes to do this surgery. Uh, it's very easy to add adjunctive procedures to it. Um, and most people uh, do very, very well with it. A lot of times it's done just under local anesthesia, sometimes with a little bit of light sedation. And but what most about recovery? Recovery is very, very, um, from what I've heard, very, very, uh, uh, it's very amenable to uh, just a few days to usually most of what we see is between five to seven days. That's a big difference. And what about if you don't want even a, a smart lift, if you don't want any sort of surgery like that at all, what other things can you do? Well, um, the gold standard of wrinkle reduction and, and skin resurfacing, so-called rejuvenate your skin, uh, has always been the carbon dioxide laser, uh, which came out in the early 90s. Uh, but that was uh, left people red and uh, unfortunately um, uh, associated with bruising and, and swelling for a good two, two to three weeks. Now there's something that just came out uh, that we use in my practice and it's the, it's the carbon dioxide laser but it's microfractionated. Uh, that allows us to, uh, the patient to have a much quicker recovery, uh, usually between three to five days uh, with very, very similar if not better results. And I know we have a photo of that. John, if, our director, if you can put that up. Uh, tell us what we're looking at here. This patient, where do you see the before and after of the laser? The right side, the right-sided pictures are the after photos. And you could really see she had some acne scarring, how nicely it helped her. And recovery for that? That was about a week and a half. But uh, she, was, she was doing much better at three to four days afterwards. Okay, yeah. so it is possible. Dr. Alvarez thank, you Sessa, thank you so much for coming on. We sure appreciate it. Pleasure. So now you know what we all want for Christmas. And if you'd like more information, go to mysuncoast.com and click onto My Suncoast Health. That's where you'll see the website for Dr.